this is problem 17 of 10b and 13 of 12b. It says a rectangular box B has distinct edge, length A, B, and C. Okay. So if we draw, it will be something like this. For example, this one. This, this, and this. Okay. So it is, for example, A, 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 and this one is A, this one B, 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 and this one C, 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 and this one C. Okay, it says the sum of length of all 12 edges of P is 13. So how many A's, for example, are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 A's, 4 B's, 4 C's. So 4 times A plus B plus C equals 12. Equals 13. This one. The sum of the areas of all six faces is 11 over 2. So AB, AB, this face front and back. So 2 times AB plus BC, top and bottom, plus AC, right and left, equals 11 over 2. And the volume is 1 over 2. Volume is what? ABC. ABC is 1 over 2. And then it wants the largest. Uh, the longest interior diagonal connecting two vertices of P. Okay, so first we want to find ABC, and for this one we should use the idea I told you before. I had told you before exam we had a formula. Okay, if we have for example ax cubed plus bx squared plus cx plus d equals zero. Then if the roots are R1, R2, R3, R1 plus R2 plus R3 is negative B over A. And the proof is not hard. You can write it as A times X minus R1, X minus R2, and X minus R3. And then consider related coefficients. Then you can prove it is this, R1, R2. For general polynomial degree N, we have Vieta's formula. R1, R3 plus R2, R3 equals c over a and r1 r2 r3 for some constant term is a negative d over a now i want to write a polynomial that the roots are a b c okay so for writing that let first i simplify a plus b plus c is what is 13 over 4 a b plus b c plus a c is what 11 over 4 and a b c is what 1 over 2 also, I released the I had released a problem related to SMT Stanford Math Tournament. In that problem, we had two roots and we used same formula. So the idea of this problem, we had this formula we have in SMT Stanford Math Tournament, Harvard MIT Math Tournament, and other exams. Okay, now let's define a polynomial. The Satisfies Vieta's formula. I say x cubed, sum of the roots negative b over a. So I say negative 13 over 4 x squared. Okay, so sum of the roots will be what? Negative this, 13 over 4. For this one, I write plus 11 over 4 x. And for last one, negative 1 half equals 0. Now, I multiply this by 4. It will be 4 x cubed minus. 13x squared plus 11x minus 2 equals 0. Second idea that is useful, idea 1, idea 2. When the degree is greater than or equal 3. If degree is 2, you can use polynomial. You can use quadratic formula. If the degree is at least 3, try to find at least one root by plugging different values. Try to find at least one root. Then you can factorize at least one root. Check plus minus 1, 0, plus minus 2, and so on. Here, if you check 1, if x is 1, then it will be 4 minus 13 plus 11 minus 2. 4 minus 13 is negative 9. 11 minus 2 is plus 9, 0. So because x1 is 1 root, you can factor from x minus 1. You can factorize. 1 factor is x minus 1. Now let's create this. I want to create, uh, I want to create 4x cubed. So I place 4x squared. It will be what? 4x cubed minus 4x squared. So I want to reach negative 13x squared. So I place negative 9x. So I have negative 9x squared. Then we will have negative 13. 
x squared minus 9x times minus 1 plus 9x. I want to reach 11x, so I place plus 2. So it will be plus 2x minus 2. It will be exactly this. 0. Now for this one, we can use quadratic formula or you can factorize. Okay, both of them are possible. So let's factorize. I prefer to factorize. I write 4x and here x. So 4x squared. 2. I should place 1, negative 1, negative 2. Negative 2 for here. Negative 4, 8x. Negative x, negative 9x equals 0. So the roots are what? 1, 2 and this one 0. 1 over 4. So a, b, c are these values without loss of generality. We can consider for so a is 1, b is 2, c is 1 over 4. Now if you want to find longest diagonal, it will be like this one. Okay, And the formula is, you can draw this one, it will be b squared. Let me call this one x, we want to find x. This one is y. Oh, let's consider because we had x w. This one, for example, is y. We know y is w squared is what is a squared plus y squared. Y by Pythagorean theorem. Y squared is what is b squared plus c squared. We can call it as idea. It will be idea three, I think. Yes, idea three, the length of longest interior diagonal of the cube cuboid here. So the answer will be square root of a squared plus b squared plus c squared. So it will be 1 plus 2 squared 4 plus 1 over 4 squared 1 over 16. So if we use common denominator 16, 1 plus 4, 5 times 16, 80 plus 1, 81. If you can say square root, it will be 9 over 4. So the answer is 9 over 4. Before exam, I said I had released video in algebra, combinatorics, geometry, and uh, number theory. And I explained Vieta's formula. If you want to learn how to approach problems like this, how to solve problems related to Vieta's formula, and other topics, feel free to send a message to my WhatsApp number in the description.